Hey, I'm Andy. We're back with another Pokemon opening, unpacking, whatever you want to call this. And this time we have a tin, a Giratina. I think it says it on somewhere. Uh, let's let's check the back. So let's see, uh, Pokemon TCG hidden potential tin. So I got this on um, during the GameStop sale during the holidays. Uh, probably not the holidays by the time this gets up, but uh, yeah, as you can see, it says it contains. One foil card featuring Rotom V, Gallade V, or Giratina V. Uh, we also got five TCG booster packs and a code card for Pokemon TCG Live. And yeah, as you saw at the beginning, we got the Giratina one. And when you order, or at least when I order from the GameStop site, we, or no, we, uh, when I ordered from the GameStop site, there was no option. It was just a random. You just get whatever they give you, so we got the Giratina one. So yeah, let's open this and check out the packs, the 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 five booster packs. Let's see if I can actually open this plastic without using a knife. <laughs> Usually, when there's like a hole. There we go. So this is the I believe this is my second Pokemon tin. The first one I did was the. Pokeball, which, I mean, was more, I guess, it's like more, uh, more of a, uh, plate, a plate, like a thing you could just put around, whereas this is just, you can just store stuff. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm good, I'm good with words, so, let's see, let's open up this. Alright, so, I can see here that's actually, there's like a lot of plastic in there, I thought, I thought it would just be just put the cards in without any plastic, but I mean it is what it is. So let's she has a lot of plastic. <laughs> All right, so yeah, here we got the Giratina V as shown uh, at the very beginning. Is there, oh yeah, there. So the card is right. Uh, the TCG code is right under it. So we're gonna put that to the side. So like with with this shape of a tin, like with the corners cut, I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to store, but I'll, I'll think of something. So, as it said on the back, uh, there is five Pokemon TCG booster packs, and it doesn't tell you, at least, I don't I don't think the GameStop site tells you, but yeah, the tin itself doesn't tell you what you get. Let, let's actually put the tin aside. So, let's see what packs we got. I, I don't know if this is the same with all the tins. Like I said, this is my... I guess second ten and the first one was just Pokemon Go. So we got Sword and Shield Lost Origin. Okay. We got another Lost Origin with a different artwork. A little bit scuffed, but uh, we, we got Sword and Shield Fusion Strike, Chilling Rain, and another Chilling Rain. So we got two Chilling Rains. Uh, we got Fusion Strike and two Lost Origins. Okay, so... Hopefully we get some decent stuff, but I guess we'll save the Fusion Strike for last. So let's open up, I guess let's open up the Chilling Rain first. So, don't know what we're going to get, but we'll, I guess we'll see. Alright, so let's start this. Hopefully we get some cool stuff. And we already got one that I have not seen before. So, we got a uh, Brad Brawler. Okay, cool. Put this down here. We get a snow runt. I mean, I guess this is one of the sets that I haven't opened the uh, multiple packs, like many packs for. So, yeah, I guess we'll we'll see some new stuff. So we got a Weedle to training. That's adorable. All right, we got a cast form uh, in yarn form. I assume <laughs> that's adorable. So we got a quill quillfish. Okay. Yeah, and I don't think I've seen that before, so we got a I guess I guess this is called a reverse hollow, if my memory serves me correctly when I'm most looking up the cards online. So yeah, we got a the wacky. <laughs> Alright, so that that's the foil. Alright. So and then we got a we got a shaman, which is a rare, so I assume that the the rares for this set if it's not like a reverse hollow or whatever will have the foil within the border i know at least some sets don't do that 
well like the Pokemon Go set does. So yeah, it is what it is. So I guess we'll put that there. Get our energy. We got a Haunter. Uh, we got a Flannery. And we got a Crabominable. Krab Krab <laughs> okay. I, I've never heard of that before. All right. On to the next one. I mean, like I said with all of these, I don't... I, I, I don't buy them in hopes of like, making even or making money from it. But if, if I do, then it's a nice surprise. But yeah, I'm just doing this for the experience. And I will do magic soon. But <laughs> just gotta wait for the cars to arrive, so... Yeah, we got another cast form. Okay, we got another quill fish. Hey, we got a Ralts. Nice. Uh, let's put that there. We got a Heracross. Okay. We got another... Oh, this is the sunny form cast form. Okay. That's adorable. <laughs> do I have a fire? I do not have a fire pile. Let's just put uh, off, off the camera. So we got a reverse... So I guess this one will always give you a hollow? Okay. Uh, this one is a reverse hollow rare. Okay. It's a little bit hard to see with the, the camera clear, but um, Frostlass. Neat. All right, we'll put that in the rare pile. And we got a Go Lurk. So I guess that is... So I guess it's not always the case, So because th this is also a rare and the, the inner frame is not um, holographic. So, okay. It, I mean, it is what it is, so... I don't know these sets, so just seeing what it is. So we got a Cybold. Okay. Where did I put that? Oh, right there. We got a Cur Cur Curlia. I guess it's the evolved form from Ralts. So, all right. And we got Agatha. All right. Oh, so those, those were the two Chilling Rain packs onto the two Lost Origins. All right. So I don't like I said I don't know what what these sets contain for the most part. <laughs> I mean, obviously I, I can assume that is a suggestive pose, <laughs> right? When I open up this pack. All right. So as I said, suggestive pose, pseudo widow. <laughs> Just that pose. I, I don't know. Let's put that there. We got a Phantom. Okay. Okay. Here's what it is. We got a Gligar. This, like, the art for this looks very basic. Like, as you can see, like, the the background and stuff. It just looks very basic compared to all the other ones. So, let's see. Like, we got a... Ooh, we got a Scopet. Nice. Those, those, those cheeks. We got a Metatite. So like, like, see, like you can see, like there's some. It feels like there was some more effort put in the background for this one than in the the glider. You can see at the bottom of the screen there. So it is what it is. We got a, a reverse hollow arc phone. Okay, and we got a Galarian Perserker V. Okay, cool. Like I don't know how much these are, but uh, Galarian Perserker V. <laughs> All right, and we got a black card. Okay, I think before, instead of the energies, I also got like a V Max card. I don't know. I don't know what these cards are for. Are they just, are they just junk? Because I know at, at least with the energies, you can at least do something with them, put them in the deck. But yeah, I don't know. No, I mean, I it does say V Star in the back, so <laughs> it, it is what it is. So we got a box of disaster. Okay. Cool. Let's put that there. We get a Galarian Stun Fisk. <laughs> that, uh, that, that face. <laughs> is that a face or is that a nose? Or, I mean, is that a mouth or is that a nose? It looks like a mouth to me. <laughs> doing that surprise, the, doing that surprise face. I mean, I, I could be wrong, but yeah. Cool. And we got a Surviper. What is that art? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I like that art, but okay, we got a Survivor. <laughs> cool. All right, next up, the this pack. 
hopefully we get some stuff. No, this one's a little bit hard to open. Oh, there we go. Just have to open it from the bottom. All right, so we got a Wurmple. Neat. We got another Gligar. Okay. We had a love disc. I mean, again, this is like pretty basic, but in terms of like the art style, but I mean, it, it is what it is. Uh, we had an Electrike. That was our first electric Pokemon. We got our uh, Pseudo Widow in this position. <laughs> we got a, a Reverse Hollow Hisuian Gurda. Gudra. Okay, cool. I like this one is, I don't know what this energy symbol is, but I do like the how the the foil looks in terms of color. All right, and we got a Cresselia. All right, cool. And we got Fire Energy. We got a Gastrodon. I think I've seen this before. I just never knew the name. All right, we got a Lost Vacuum. Okay, <laughs> and we got a uh, Relicant. The art, like, the art has been mixed for me, but, I mean, it is what it is. I mean, I'm more used to, like, the Pokemon Go one since I, that's the most recent one that I opened as of this recording, so. All right, our last one, Fusion Strike. Hope we get some stuff. <laughs> I mean, hope we get some shiny stuff. All right, let's see. What do we got? Oh, we got a Staryu. Okay, cool. All right, first card, Staryu. Nice. Next we get a Mawile? Mawile. Never seen that or heard of that before. All right, we got a Makuhita. Nice. We got a Panpour. Like, uh, so far, like, this one has, like, the most, um, like, this batch has, like, a lot of adorable looking ones. We got a Seawaddle. Okay, cool that there no we got a that is a long name toge toge tomorrow okay that uh no it's uncommon but well, that's so that's so round <laughs> okay I, like i don't know if this this is that related to togepi not probably not <laughs> but anyways sure all right let's put that there we got a uh, genesect v i mean this looks cool. A, a Genesect V. Like, I do like the artwork. Like, I don't know. Like, for me, like, I really like the artwork for this one. Alright, let's put that there. Energy. We get, oh, that Zeru looks awesome, too. <laughs> like, I don't know, like, th there's, like, some very basic ones, and then uh, some really cool-looking ones. Like, I don't know. Like, look at... Can you like compare? I don't know. It, maybe maybe it's just me. So oh, we got a Zarud. We got a Delcaddy. Okay. And we got a Darkrai. I mean, I guess this is a different set compared to the Gligar, but yeah. So yeah. I also forgot to mention that one of the cards I found in uh, the Pokemon Go one was actually a Ditto too, which was uh, the Reverse Hollow Bidoof, which was very interesting. I, like, I didn't know that until I was actually reading up on their site I was, when I was trying to redeem the codes for Pokemon Go, so... Yeah, so I guess of the of the five packs we got... Was it five? Yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah of, the, of the five packs we got, uh, the rares we got were Genesect V. Alright, we got a Cresselia with a foil picture. Alright. We got a Hisuian Gudra with a foil, uh, with the reverse hollow, with uh, just the back of it, not the picture. We got a Galarian Perserker V. I feel like I got this before. I don't know if I did. Cause my memory's kind of bad. <laughs> we got the Golurk, which is just the basic one without any type of hollow. We got a Frostlass uh, reverse hollow. All right, and we got a shaman with a holographic picture in the middle. So, yeah, and, uh, like I said, I look up. I'll look up the cards online afterwards. But 
I don't know the prices during, so I'd say seven seven rares out of five packs. I'd say that's better than average, I guess. Like I don't I don't know how how the rare works. Like I don't know the odds of the rare for the foil. So yeah, that was the hidden potential tin. I guess, I guess that's what it's called. Uh, let's see. Yeah, the TCG hidden the uh, Pokemon TCG hidden potential tin. So, yeah, that's what I got for this tin. So, I have a few more stuff to open, but that will just be weekly, and then hopefully by then I'll get some magic cards arrived. So, yeah, it is what it is. So, hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, thank you for watching and have a nice day.